All right, guys, we're out here fucking at some random fucking shitty gas station in Ukaipa or some shit. And uh, it's another beautiful dual vlog with Suburban Delinquent because Arson Rides forgot his center like a dumb dickhead. Dumb dickhead. Diddly dick. Nice I'm and set. To do another dual vlog with Mr. Bitch, I was trying to shake your hand like a legit oh. business partnership. It is a business partnership. Slash, e slash fucking erotic partnership. Mm. He knows up with that. Dude, you're trying to cream pie me again. <laughs> we just had cream pieology. And then of course we got good old Tony Carbajal, who you guys haven't seen him forever. He's just sitting there like, come on. <laughs> some room too. I was that fucking polite for you. <laughs> did you feel that? I just touched your ass. You did? Yeah. I'm so used to my ass being touched that I didn't even feel it. Your ass is let's get, it, let's get another touch. I feel bad for Arson. He's over there just his lone self. He's probably talking mad shit. Oh no, I know he's talking mad shit in his vlog. He's probably like these two fucking fuck boys right here fucking on a Cena and I forgot mine. You get thirsty? All over again. I got something to quench your thirst. I don't want cream pies. Here it comes, here it comes. Hey! Got it! Did you catch it? I caught it. I thought that was a cop truck. Cops are so hard to spot now. They have so many different types of fucking cars. Hell yeah. I wish they'd all stick to those goddamn Crown Vicks and call it a day. I know, they're either on like fucking Astro Vans and shit. I'm having some Netflix and chill with my bike. Oh my god. You and Arson are both fucking. He's plowing it. Look, I'm a stunter because I'm standing on my pegs. Look, I'm stunt rider right now. Is, are, are you jealous? You've never done cool shit like this before. No, I really, I just needed to air out my asshole. I'm gonna give you my rope draft. This is a nice part of Cali I've never been through. Cool little view. Boop, 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 boop. Mm, bitch. Last time I went up here with Tony, you got a flat fucking tire. At the top, we were fucked. He rode all the way down the hill with a flat tire. I've never been so scared for anybody. Yeah, I would not do that shit. Like, his tire was fucking flat. Like, his whole bike? It, I don't know, dude. That dude's, like, fucking talented as fuck. He's always so mellow when he's riding on the street, and then, like, you see him at a show, and he's, he's out of his fucking mind. It's like Clark Kent and Superman. Mm, smells like ass. Damn, they're all having some like fucking rock safari up there or down there. Damn, that looks like a fucking poster right there at the at the back right there. <laughs> it's like so clear. Man, I can't, I can't never uh, be ungrateful for where we live. Yeah, it's pretty cool. What I've always liked about California is you could go surfing and snowboarding all in the same day. <laughs> yeah, that's true. I want to go face first into one of these cars. That'd be fun. You'd go out like fucking Jax Teller style. Probably look good on the GoPro footage. You know the GoPro would survive it. Those things fall out of like airplanes and shit and they survive. They'd have to extract it from your fucking throat. Oh, well, yours is on the side of your helmet. Mine go right through my head. Ooh, I get I get like that heebie jeebie feeling when we uh when you get really high in the air, I always feel that way. Scared of heights, are you? 
So it depends, like shit like this, yeah. But like not necessarily all the time. I just hate when I look over an edge and know that there's like some fire fucking drop right there. You know it'd suck if there was like a fire and we were just stranded. And everybody knew they were gonna die. Fuck that. How would you spend your last like fucking 20 minutes on Earth? Fucking playing Metal Gear Solid? <laughs> I'd probably sit on my thumb and rotate. See like that, that's what I'm talking about. Oh shit! I almost <laughs> you almost <laughs> hit my hand. But wouldn't it suck to like go out the road and hit a tree that size? You wouldn't even like shake a fucking branch if you hit it. You mean hitting it? Like run off the road and fucking fire right into those trees. so much further than I thought it was. It is far. I knew it would be far when I looked at the Google Maps and it was 45 miles from my house. H have you ever been up to Big Bear? Nope. Oh shit. Really? Yep. That's why I told you, I was like, I'm more excited for the ride here than anything. Like this blanket, it looked like Somebody fucking dumped like a gallon of Elmer's glue all over it. That's how much cum was on it. How do you know it was jizz? Because it was, it was obvious. Are your balls sweat? No, my, my balls are actually pretty uh, nice. Look at this chick right here. Look at these, look at these nice skinny legs and that nice tight ass. Oh shit, it's suburban. It looks like we had a bunch of bomb ass riding adventures up to Big Bear. So uh, let's close this in with a big group hug and uh, continue on our day. Don't forget to subscribe to Baker Eggs and Dickheads. <laughs>
Yeah. 